And tonight, a school in a community mourning the loss of a beloved fourth grade teacher. Emily Howell died in a car accident just this morning, minutes from the school where she taught. Fox House Alexa Liako joining us from the live desk with a look at how the Paulding community is honoring her tonight. Alexa? Well, everyone we spoke to just heartbroken over this news and a memorial with flowers and balloons was up just hours after friends learned Emily Howell had died in a car accident on Dallas Ackworth Highway. I spoke with a parent whose son had Howell as a tutor for the past two years, and she says he cried himself to sleep after hearing the news today. I couldn't imagine. I couldn't imagine being that parent that had to break that news to their son or daughter. Just feeling the pain or seeing the pain on their face, you know, they seen this teacher every day. I couldn't imagine telling them that they're not going to see that teacher again. Emily Howell taught fourth grade at Russum Elementary. Howell was on her way into school when the crash happened. And my heart dropped and I just felt completely sad and you know it's just like it, it hits home. It's like right down the street. It hits home. Tamara Ford's son attends Russum Elementary and she says she was shocked to get the tragic email this morning. When I heard that my heart dropped. My heart completely dropped. Neighbors and friends quickly put up flowers and balloons to remember the woman they describe as truly beautiful. It, it has impacted the school com community pretty hard because you it just the school is a community it's a family and Paulding School District released this statement saying Ms. Howell was a very dedicated teacher and her students always came first she was a hard worker who volunteered for numerous clubs and out of class activities and she was an excellent communicator with parents she will be dearly missed. I'm actually praying for the community and everybody that's involved in this tragic accident. Um, I'm praying for the family that was involved and I, I pray that we all can come together and heal from this.